Hey guys, just got this request from a fan and I'm gonna show you how to make the same effect we see in this video right now. It's a pretty easy one once you get the basics. First I'm just going to drag any clip I want in my, my project and then I drag it on my create a new comp button. So it gives me a composition with my full length of my video. I'm having my clip here, I duplicate it, Control D. Now I have two clips. And then I need to move it to create a split screen. So to do so, I'm going to set my title action safe on so that I can see clearly where the middle is. And I'm opening my transform settings. In position here, I'm just going to move it like this. It's easy. Uh, you remove your title action safe because you don't need it. Both clips are moving at the same time, but in the example, we could see that there was a delay between both clips. So that means there's one clip that has to be after the other one. So I'm just going to drag it a little bit, just so that it's not always the same movement. And if your clip now is not long enough for your composition, you can always move your co composition trim here. And then you go in composition, trim come to work area. Now we need to add the, the Venetian effect to it, which gives it this like old TV distortion look. You go in layer, new, adjustment layer, and you write in effect in presets, you write Venetian, and it's Venetian blind. So in transition completion, I'm gonna write 12% direction. Like right now, it's, it's, it's still nice, you can always do that, but I feel like for a split screen in this direction, it works better. So I'm gonna write 90 degrees. And maybe 8 for the width. And I'm gonna add a feather. So you see that we get these lines now. Uh, by the way, to move like that with this little N, I'm just pushing on my middle mouse button so I can travel now. So now we have our two split screen and we have our effect on top of it. We still have to add some movement on it, like it's like an old clip and it's shaky. So I'm going to select everything and right click and choose pre-comp. And you can add a title, let's call it like wiggle. Wiggle. And in my wiggle, now it's like a new comp. I'm going in the transform settings and I'm going to alt click on position. Alt on my keyboard and I click on the watch and now I can change this here. I'm going to write wiggle and I think 20 comma 5 and you click somewhere else. So now it added some kind of like shake and you can see it by like there's like new little black lines on the sides because like it's shaking outside of the screen so we need to maybe scale our, our footage up a little bit so we don't get that so i'm going in scale and i choose 102 so now if it's moving then it's not going to it's not going to be black on the border and i love you guys have a super nice day bye bye <laughs>